This is my cooks, Mr. Bills, and honored to have you here. You're seeing my leaves are all shredded. Well, we got golf ball size hail. Beat us up pretty good. But I'm not going to curse God because the other side of town got baseball size hail. So I'm grateful for the least that we got. And uh, the garden, most of it will come back and produce a fair amount yet. With that in mind, though, hail isn't the only danger that you face when you're gardening. Out here in southwest Nebraska, we have a bunch of rattlesnakes, and rightly so. Uh, it's nothing to see a, a rattlesnake with 13 babies, nothing at all. The record of a single rattlesnake producing 23 is still stands as a record. So they are massive numbers, and you just can't get rid of them. That's just all there is to it. But you can cut their numbers every chance you get. Every chance you get. Now, a garden is a prime location for a snake to like. Heavy ground cover, you're going to water it so he gets all the water he wants. And of course, rodents might be around and or they'll also, the small snakes will also take a grasshopper or other bugs. And so they've got it pretty well made in there. The downside is they are deadly poisonous and if they bite you, you're looking at tens of thousands of dollars to save your life or Never forget, anti-venom does not always work. What I always push and suggest as strong as I possibly can to any gardener is when you're out there harvesting in the middle of July like right now, wear a pair of leather gloves. A small snake is going to have a hard time getting through that leather glove. The two women that were bit reached in to pick tomatoes. That was all they did and they got hit. One in the finger. Now they both have survived, but the one with the one finger lost all the feeling in it and all the nerves in it and so it just hangs there for the rest of her life she will not have any use of that finger so a pair of leather gloves would have made the difference so just as wearing a seat belt can save your life gloves can also now the other thing that you can do to try to protect yourself some though out in your garden is on the non rainy days and uh, quiet days no wind so the dust isn't blowing just put out glue boards. I said a glue board out in your garden. You'll be surprised how many uh, snakes that you do catch by using glue boards. The non-venomous snakes can be released. The poisonous snakes can be destroyed. And that's what we push. That's what we push. And that's my goal is to keep you safe. It's dangers are out there, whether it be hail or rattlesnakes. You got to learn to live with and how to protect yourself against them when possible. And that's what I do here, and that's what I'm advising you to do. You rate this film, you have a safe year.